Hi guys, how you doing? It's me, Stone Gray Phillips. How are you? I'm doing fine. We're gonna play Minecraft. Our first video, our first walkthrough, and our first apartment. So you got texture packs. You can like retexture and make it look different. Then you got languages. You can do Dutch. You can do English. You can do French. You can do pirate English. You can do Canadian English. And then of course we got single player and multiplayer. They're both self-explanatory. So I'm gonna single player. I'm gonna call it Swag Play. Swag Play. You know. Because it's like a let's play, except it's swag, you know. Two G's, because one G is too mainstream. And we're gonna go to game mode. You got survival, which is like very hard. No, well, not hard. Hardcore is hard. Okay, so survival is like a hard version. No, not a hard version. Survival is like where you have to fend for yourself. You could die of starvation, you could die of like the undead. And you have to like get your own stuff. And then hardcore is like the Asian level of that. And then you got creative, which. You could just fly around, do whatever you want to do, instantly destroy blocks, instantly replace blocks. You just have like a menu of which blocks you want. So yeah. Okay, so let's get somewhere. Oh yeah. Also, you could put seeds. Like it's like the general blueprint of it. We're gonna give it swag. I don't know what it'll do. Then you got super flower or default. It's pretty much like very black and white, but like it's like another blueprint, like another general blueprint of the map. Then you have generate structures, which is like towns. Dungeons, fortresses, etc., etc. Do you want those to be there? Um, we're gonna say yes because it opens up some new mobs and new interactions. So yeah, the meme bar I just uploaded to the top left-hand corner that will represent my emotions or feelings at that moment. Now we're waiting for it to load. Waiting. Waiting, yes, now might be a bit laggy. Minecraft needs to make it wait. Open E, yes, got the achievement right off. We got the achievement. Achievements they could be a bit simple, but as you get on, they get much harder. So, we got wood, yes, another achievement. Wow, well, this is going well. Let me explain the controls. Ah, oh, trying to kill that pig there. Let me explain the controls. W A S E is to move, use the mouse to look around, left click, primary function. Right click, secondary function. Primary function is to break things, secondary function is to destroy things. Now I'm trying to kill that pig. Now, the wolves, you could actually tame them by giving them pork slash bacon. It's going real well. Let me explain the stuff at the bottom. Now, the nine boxes at the bottom, that's like the hotkey part of your inventory. You do that by, you get whatever you need to get there by pressing the one through nine keys. Or scrolling up and down. The bar on top of that is like your experience bar, which you get by killing things. Now, the hard thing on the left is your health. It slowly it decreases in A, you starve to death. B, you're losing oxygen, like you're choking to death or you're drowning to death. Or C, is that you just get killed or you hurt yourself. And then the, what looks like the chicken legs is your hunger meter. So slowly it will drain out, and if it drains out, then you'll be starving to death. So you need to keep yourself well fed. That's also another reason why I'm hunting the bacon. So the tree, the object of day one is to cut down all the trees you can, or at least get enough wood, and then make a shelter before night comes, because that's when the zombies. Now you just need that one just to get a hang on to Minecraft. But we're going to take it a little bit more than that. Oh, we're going to build an underwater home which is something most first-time minecrafters won't do we're also gonna make a decent size living room we're gonna get stone tools we're gonna get like an oven halfway in the first day see another achievement we're doing good we're doing good we're doing good we're getting some um we're also gonna get materials for glass because the day is about 25 30 minutes correct me if i'm wrong so we should be working fairly well now, you have to kind of convert the materials from tree to plank to stick to get what you want. And then you need the crafting table because most of your things you have to craft will be 3x3. Three three. Now, what you gotta understand is you can convert as least amount of tree as possible because you want to get charcoal. Why? Because you might run out of coal. Another achievement you might run out of coal, you might not have the coal. Coal is too mainstream, or coal says balls to you, like that lesbian person. So, you don't have to get, you don't have to immediately chop down the trees, but get to it soon and focus on chopping down the trees. 
don't wander around saying how awesome the environment is. Now the environment is awesome. It's great, it's crude, it's compatible with many great map packs. And that's the resolution is great. You got 3D, which is decent. Now, Minecraft was made by Marcus Allegex person in mid 2010, about May, April. And it was made in Sweden. In Stockholm, most likely. And then as it grew from the cave game to mining like minecrafting it grew into something that requires several people something that goes across from northern europe to western europe to america maybe even asia and africa so this game is marvelous it my, in my opinion it rises above call of duty you got multiplayer and it's just awesome how the minecrafters just rise because call of duty and halo it's just like you know you un you know it's already expected of them to have like a bustling amount of fans and millions of players whereas minecraft they kind of had to like struggle and considering how like grew into so much it's amazing so now we're going to dig an underwater home but first i want to get some stone now to do that you're going to need a wood pickaxe so we're going to need an extra plank i'm going to need some more sticks now generally when you craft you want to form the general shape of the object like you want to form the hatchet or you put like the wood to the side in the corner and then you put the sticks in the middle it's relatively intuitive but one uh, another achievement but once we get to the point where we're going to be baking we're going to be farming we're going to be like we're going to be wizardry let me just say it because it also includes magic potions and stuff no, that becomes a bit more counterintuitive. Now, I'm mining stone. I want 12. Three for, like, a hatchet or a pickaxe, and then the other nine for the oven slash furnace. So, we got a hatchet. Now, we could just get wood way faster. Stone is more efficient. It's better, and it's stronger. So, you can chop down the trees faster. And you could... Be chopping trees longer so it works out either way and pretty much wood becomes obsolete at this point so within what takes people two days two or three days what we just did we just did it in like half a day a quarter of a day that's the thing for like the first two days most people will be using a wood pickaxe whereas like a quarter of the day in we are already using a stone pickaxe and we're already getting our decoration, which is the flowers. So we're doing real great. We're also chopping down trees very well. We're getting extra. You just need at least 11. But we're doing much more than we actually need. Oh, yeah, chicken. There. I'm probably not going to give the chicken to the dogs. Considering how they're probably different ones. That's the thing. Wolves, they despawn more easily compared to other ones. Yes. And that thing I, you saw me killing earlier, that was a pig. Mm -hmm. I know, you have to get used to the crude style. They can make it more complex. Because then that, at that level, goes beyond the texture packs as help. But, they can make it just like the default texture pack. They could just make it a bit more complex. But, I like it this style. The reason why you're wondering why Steve is gray, not blue, is because gray is my favorite color and my middle name is gray. My middle name. So, I'm going to craft something. Let's see, what should we craft? We're gonna probably, oh yeah, we're gonna create a trap door, but that's gonna require a Ah, <sighs> one more wood. And the feathers, we could use that for bow and arrows. Well, the arrow part, of course. And the trap door, well, that's like a vertical door. Now, since it it's a solid object occupying a space, which is one cubic meter, blocks are one cubic meter, it was made in Europe. Since it's this one thing blocking cubic meter, water cannot go through the holes. It's just this one thing. And we're going to get some more grass. Not grass. Sand for the glass. Oh, if we had a shovel, we could break up the, the snow. We can make, like, you know, a snowman, but not now. Oh, we can make a snow golem, but that's useless. Okay, so we're going to fast forward soon. Oh, like me getting the underwater home. I hope you guys enjoy that. We're going to be getting there in 3, 2, 1.
So we got the shovel, we're not gonna go in there. The water bubbles represents your breath. You could slowly die from it. But if you're health but if you're like fully well fed, you could recharge it. So we're gonna dig a shaft down to the side. We're gonna go adjust the particle effects. I'm gonna talk more about that sooner. We're gonna go down. Dang, we're gonna dig around inside the shaft. I'm gonna make a separate video about it. So we got there. Place get I got a feel for it, so I'm just gonna place the the workbench, and we're gonna make a furnace slash oven slash Bunsen burner. And what we're gonna do with it is that we're gonna make. Yeah, okay. So we got another chip. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make charcoal, which we could use to cook stuff with, and to make you know torches with. I'll get more on that later. So we're gonna fast forward a little bit more. So now I'm just digging out the living room part, which is the main part of my house. To my heart's desire, which is, you know, the blueprints I made in real life. I'll show it to you in a separate video, in a video game blog. So now on to the other part. So get the charcoal. Or, you know, I'll just get the wood aside. Now the reason why I was fast forwarding is because the parts are critical, but you only get the critical value at a large scale. So I fast forwarded so we get what we got, but in a short amount of time. Now, the reason why I didn't fast forward the other parts is because I needed to explain what was needed to explain, whereas I didn't need to the other ways. I hope I made myself clear. So let me get that sand. Oh, wow. Okay, so sand has two main purposes. Sandstone and glass. Two, two purposes. So, here's, so I'm going to tell you in the next part the main project I have in mind. So I'm just clearing out this room, gotta get the dirt, gotta get the dirt, gotta gotta get the dirt, mm, dirt. Bam, 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 okay I'll stop. Oh, video is about to end. Hope you guys like it. So we put a lot of work into it. So I hope you leave a like there. Cole's too mainstream. You leave a like there and subscribe. This walkthrough I hope was real helpful. It was real handy. It was fun to watch. See you guys later. In part two. Just one tiny. Oh, yeah.